Stop! Do you know 90% of Singaporeans have some form of gum disease? Hi, I'm Dr. Cheng, the founder of iDental. I'm here to answer some of the most popular internet questions on gum disease. First question. Ta -da -da -da. What is gum disease? Gum disease is the disease of the gum. <laughs> A gum disease is actually a persistent bacterial infection of the tissue around the teeth. Question 2. Ta -da! What is the best way to treat gum disease? Okay, the best way to treat gum disease involves a combination of professional gum care and good oral hygiene practice at home. Third question. Eh? Five seconds. <laughs> Third question. Is my life over if I have gum disease? I don't think so. Lah. Gum disease can be treated. So first of all, you can do regular brushing at least three times a day, do some flossing, and of course, there are some areas that we might miss. So it's still recommended to see a dentist. Number four, no, always short of one. Number four, does gum disease cause heart disease? That's a very interesting question. Yes, uh, a lot of people don't believe gum is related to the heart, but actually studies have shown that people with higher incidence of gum disease have a correlated higher incidence of heart disease. So that's why maintaining good oral hygiene is very important for overall well-being of your body. Question 5. Does gum disease go away when teeth are removed? Of course, when there are no teeth, there will be no gum disease. The gum disease affects the supporting structure around the teeth. So when there's no teeth, there's no supporting structure around the teeth, then how can it be a gum disease? That's the reason why we must take care of our teeth so that we have no gum disease. And without gum disease, you will not have to wear dentures. The last question, can you fix gum disease without the dentist? Oh yes, of course, you can fix simple gum disease. With simple gum disease, we call it gingivitis. Basically, it involves inflammation around the superficial layers of the gum near the teeth. There will be bleeding, a bit of swelling, but because it's so superficial, you are able to brush well, clean well with some mouth rinse, you are able to treat it. But anything deeper than that, we call it periodontitis. It generally involves the bone surrounding the teeth. So you need a dentist to go in and clean those areas which is way deeper than your toothbrush can reach. Do you have any other questions for Dr. Cheng? Come on down and have a chat with me. Dr. Cheng can make your smile slay.